Hi everyone! Good afternoon guys! So today, right in front of you is a Bauer compressor. This is the Poseidon edition. I'm gonna show you. Okay, This is one of the stationary compressors of Bauer. And uh, as you will know, Bauer Poseidon edition is a brand of Bauer compressor. They are developed and manufactured in Germany, so they fulfill the highest quality and the safety requirements. So to those who don't know what is this, this is a breathing air compressor used to filling air in your scuba tanks. The model name of this compressor is Bauer Poseidon PE250 MVE. This is ideal for quiet operation or, for example, space saving location. This is a 250 liters per minute compressor that can fill four cylinders in 26 minutes at fill speed based on refill 50 to 200 bar. Right now, you can see two filling whip, but you can add like eight filling, uh, eight filling whips, for example. So, let me explain first what are these things attached to the compressor and their functions, for example. Okay. Here, this is the B control or the micro compressor control system. See, as you can see here, here you can see the operating hours of the compressor. This will be your basis or reference for the maintenance and service intervals of the compressor as well as the oil pressure temperature and the filter cartridge saturation. This is the, fun the, the function of this is to turn on and turn off the compressor. Okay, so Bauer has maintenance kit to be used to service your compressor based on running hours. So for example, they have the 500 running hours kit, the 1000 running hours kit, or the 2000 running hours kit or what we call as the overhauling kit. I'll show you some sample of uh, one of our kits. This is the IK150 2000 running hours kit or the over, overhauling kit of a Bauer Poseidon PE550. What's inside the box, for example, the reed valve, the uh, floating pistons, the inlet outlet valves, and etc. So this will be used whenever the compressor is due for 2,000 running hours. Uh, this kit will be used to service the compressor. Stop. So here is the Securus box. The function of this V Securus, this will tell you, this will tell you if the filter cartridge is saturated. So you have here some lights. Um, this one here is failure. You have here the saturated change cartridge. This is the saturated soon and the okay. So any of the lights will blink depending on the status of your filter cartridge. For example, when the lights, when the light of saturated soon is blinking, that means you have to prepare because you're about to replace the filter cartridge. So when the saturate, when the saturated change cartridge, cartridge is uh, blinking, that means you need to replace the filter cartridge. And if okay, meaning filter cartridge is still in good condition and you can still use them. Or if failure, that means there is a problem with the connection, for example, or the wirings, or etc., uh, etc. Et so the compressor has safety valves. So this is a 225 bar. The safety valves boost safety while the unit is operation. So here, you can see this is sealed. This is very important. So make sure when you run the compressor, the safety valve is in the full operation full operation mode. You can see the arrow here. Here is the arrow. Okay, you need to follow. So when you are running the compressor, it has to be fully operated. So this compressor has P41 filter cart filter housing attached with original filter cartridge from Bauer and proper compressor setup 
The purity of breathing air complies the international standard. So the filter cartridge, Bauer filters are vacuum sealed packaging to prevent pre-saturation, ensuring full life of the filter cartridge. So for automatic condensate drain, um, the automatic condensate drain added convenience. So the condensate is drained at the regular intervals during operation as well as when the unit is switched off. So water and oil are drained through the intermediate and final separators. Oil cooling in the final compression stage reduces wear and lengthens service life. For the oil level, you can check that in the sight glass where you can see the maximum and the minimum level of the oil. Right now, the compressor has the maximum, uh, maximum level of oil. Then the schedule for change oil should be done every 500 to 2,000 running hours. The integrated vibration resistant stainless steel cooling tubes here are corrosion resistant and serve to lengthen the service life of both the cartridge and the unit. Okay. There you go. So please take note that when connecting the unit to the voltage supply, please ensure the direction here, the direction of uh, the direction of uh, rotation of the unit is correct. So, if ever you have questions and um, clarifications about this compressor, please don't hesitate to message me or message Pacifica Dive in our FB pages or send us an email or call us. We are here to help you. Thank you. Bye.